how's it going? This is Marty Kelkish and this is my garage. Um, I got an email a couple days ago uh, from a girl named Kim Kimberly and uh, she had just, she's got a 1997 uh, uh, Jeep Grand Cherokee and she just had her brakes and an oil change done and uh, it's been running really crappy since then. So <coughs> my thoughts are it's probably the ignition, something ignition related if it's having trouble idling and, and stuff like that. And if it happened right after an oil change, I'm guessing maybe they weren't the best aim in some of the oil that they were trying to uh, put in here, dribbled down and got onto those spark plugs or the distributor right here, and that's, uh, that's what's causing it to run like crap. That's my guess. But um, it is throwing a check engine light. So um, uh, that makes things easier. There's uh, when you have a check engine light, um, it means some sensor or something in the car has de detected an error, and it's thrown a code. So um, I know AutoZone will do it for free. You can uh, uh, take your car to AutoZone and just tell them you want your codes pulled. They'll they'll hook up something like this. It's a uh, OBD2 reader. And I'll, I'll show you where that goes right now. I'll kind of show you what they do. So, okay, it's kind of tight quarters in here, but basically here's where this goes. You have this, uh, what do you call it, parallelogram shaped, or trapezoid shaped. Trapezoid, yeah. And uh, there is a, a disconnects. Um, on the Jeep, it's right here. You'll see a little uh, trapezoid shaped male uh, connector right there. So this just plugs into that. And uh, I think the car needs to be on. So, but on other cars and stuff, they're usually located somewhere in there. Like on my Volvo, it's like in here. But uh, that's just right there. So now it's, now it's on and everything. This, we don't have a check engine light, so it's not going to find anything. But Press link, it's reading, talking to the computer, reading the codes. Do, 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 do. And so it doesn't come up with anything because I got nothing. But it would be something like, a, like I think a, a misfire would be like P0301 or 23, whatever. Um, but it would be some like five digit code like that. And uh, you can get a book that will tell you what those codes mean, but the easiest thing to do, I think, is just to Google that and go, I have a, I have a 97, or just cheap Cran Cherokee, and then the code, and you'll probably find 10 pages that are telling you what that means. So, but th that's where I'd start, because if a cylinder is misfiring, then I'm right. <laughs> and, but, uh, I don't know. And then they can clear the codes from here and the check engine light goes away. And you fix your problem and you're all set. So that's that's all I got. Um, but if you have any questions or anything, you can email me at uh, martysgarage at gmail.com. Uh, you can watch the show streaming online at www.martoon.net. Thanks for watching.